and things. And in today's video, we're going to be cooking. So what we're going to do is, I don't know what you call it, quesadilla, fajita, I don't know. But yesterday was Taco Tuesday, and I didn't make tacos. But I figured I would kind of do Taco Tuesday today, but kind of different. So now, before see. we start the video, I need y'all to do me two favors. If you're not currently subscribed to this channel, go ahead and hit the subscribe button right now, okay? And if you're not currently subscribed to my Instagram account, go over to Instagram after you watch this video, click Homes and Things by Christy, and subscribe over there too, okay? It will help me out tremendously. And while you at it, let's throw in a third. Follow me on Newsbreak using the information here. It will really help my channel out tremendously. Appreciate you guys. Okay, so let's go ahead and talk about this. Y'all, I cut my finger again. The last time I cut my finger, it was using this. And this was no different. Now, before y'all get started, I was supposed to grab the vegetable with this. Didn't do it. And I was supposed to put on my cutting gloves. Didn't do it. But I'm doing it from now on out. It's bad, y'all. It is bad. I went to the... Uh, I went to the urgent care on Sunday. My husband didn't say a word because he done told me time and time again to be careful. So I went to the urgent care on Sunday and they fixed me right on up. It's bad. <laughs> and as it heals, I'll be able to kind of show you more but it's bad. So the first thing we're gonna do is clean and cut up our veggies. I've got an onion too, a purple onion. So let's do that first. Okay, y'all, I changed my mind. Instead of going ahead and slicing it, I'm going to season it um, and get it ready for the grill. So, first things first, use the seasoning of, the, of your choice. Now, I can tell you all day long the seasonings that I like, but if you like something different, and I will have the seasonings that I'm using on the screen, but if you like something different, just get use the seasonings of your choice. Season your chicken. Get it ready for the grill. How you um, cook it is up to you also. You can use uh, a griddle like I'm using. You can use a pan on the stove. You can put it in the oven. It's really up to you how you season it. So
bottom. I've already done that. And I set my griddle to 400. Look on my desk, babe. You ain't got 10. <laughs> I'm going to put it on in now. You see. So, just changing my glove for a fresh glove, and then we'll get started. You just don't want me to get all of them. You ate all of yours. <laughs> you don't want me to eat the rest of yours. That's why you said that. Look on my desk, babe. Huh, look up. Got me spraying somewhere. I uh coated my pan with a little Pam. Okay, now that we got the griddle nice and hot, I'm gonna go ahead and add the veggies. All right, once you take your peppers and onions off the grill, add a little more Pam and then add your chicken. Um, I didn't change the temperature, so you should hear it sizzling. And you want to grill them on both sides. You'll be able to tell by the middle when the chicken is done. But if you can't, just slice a piece, probably the thickest piece of chicken in the middle, and you'll be able to tell if it's done or not. Um, the color is the way it is because of the seasonings. Um, they were actually really moist and tender. Um, and they came out really well. So once you've completed cooking them on the griddle, it shouldn't take that long whether you do it in the pan or the griddle. Then you can go ahead and chop your chicken up. One. See how it turned out. <clears throat> I'm going to add that. Add a little cheese. Somebody can't wait. Oh, that's too much. I'm gonna add a little cheese. You got no uh... sour cream. Add a few peppers. Why you don't put sour cream on it? Chicken. Somebody got a wrap. <laughs> Get out <up>, the video. <laughs> Let's see if I can flip this. This might be too much stuff on here.
We'll let it cook a little bit on that side. Then we'll flip it on the other side. So that is what it looks like. I'm just tasting the chicken. I feel like I put too much seasoning on the chicken, but the veggies and the flatbread brought it all together. It's really good. I'm going to dip it in some sour cream and enjoy my, my um, meal. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Sorry, my mouth is full. It's so good. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you enjoy cooking videos from me and you want to see me keep keep cooking comment below see y'all later listen i said i was gonna make that first one and enjoy the rest of my night well i did but i enjoyed it with this second one so this is what the second one looked like it was really good the peppers and onions were grilled really good and then the next day my husband and i got up and went out in the ministry and when we came back he made another wrap and i made another what do you call this you guys quesadilla i guess except ours has a lot of stuff in it so anyway made another one knocked off the chicken it was really really good i'm starting to use this grill a lot so get ready get used to it I'm going to be grilling on this thing quite a bit. Um, I think that night I actually grilled some salmon and put it on top of a baked potato, but I didn't make a video. Anyway, hope you enjoyed. See you guys in the next one. Bye-bye.